changes. When atomic fire consumed the earth, those who survived did so in great underground vaults. When they opened, their inhabitants set out across the ruins of the old world to build new societies, establishing villages, forming tribes. As decades passed, what had been the American Southwest united beneath the flag of the new California Republic, dedicated to old world values of democracy and the rule of law. As the Republic grew, so did its needs. Scouts spread east, seeking territory and wealth in the dry and merciless expanse of the Mojave Desert. They returned with tales of a city untouched by the warheads that had scorched the rest of the world and a great wall spanning the Colorado River. The NCR mobilized its army and sent it east to occupy Hoover Dam and restore it to working condition. But across the Colorado, another society had arisen under a different flag. A vast army of slaves forged from the conquest of 86 tribes, Caesar's Legion. Four years have passed since the Republic held the dam, just barely, against the Legion's onslaught. The Legion did not retreat. Across the river, it gathers strength. Campfires burn, training drums beat. Through it all, the New Vegas Strip has stayed open for business, under the control of its mysterious overseer, Mr. House, and his army of rehabilitated tribal and police robots. You are a courier, hired by the Mojave Express to deliver a package to the New Vegas Strip. What seemed like a simple delivery job has taken a turn for the worse. You got what you were after, so pay up. You're crying in the rain, Pally. <laughs> Guess who's waking up over here? Time to cash out. Will you get it over with? Maybe cons kill people without looking them in the face. But I ain't a fink, dig? You've made your last delivery, kid. Sorry you got twisted up in this scene. From where you're kneeling must seem like an 18-carat run of bad luck. Truth is, the game was rigged from the start. What's up everyone, CD and Fury Games here, welcome back to the channel. And actually, today I'm playing some Fallout New Vegas. You're awake. And just started like it. Oh, can't bring back. Whoa, easy there, easy. You've been out cold a couple of days now. Why don't you just relax a second? Get your bearings. Let's see what the damage is. How about your name? Can you tell me your name? So in his ways, I decided to play some New Vegas since, uh, uh, no shit, wrong button. Well, since, uh, Fallout 4 is just around the corner, by the time you see this, it'll be 11 days from that date. I'm actually recording this on the 23rd, so you won't see this until the 30th. It's coming out November 10th, so 11 more days, so let's get the sight train started. Huh. I can't say it's what I'd have picked for you, but if that's your name, that's your name. I'm Doc Mitchell. Welcome to Good Springs. Now, I hope you don't mind, but I had to go rooting around there in your noggin to pull all the bits of lead out. I take pride in my needlework. But you'd better tell me if I left anything out of place. 
How'd I do? Next. Uh... So, anyways, this is the uh, the previous uh, Fallout game to uh, Fallout Four. And let's go with that. Hairstyle. Um, shaggy pterosaur. Last bat. Alright, so to go. Waster. Tunnel snakes. <laughs> uh, clean cut. Let's go waster. No. Pack. Hair color. Is there like a steel? Let's go for the steel color, facial hair, rough beard. Yeah, let's go for the rough beard. Yes. Well, I got most of it right anyway. Stuff that mattered. Okay. No sense keeping you in bed anymore. Let's see if we can get you on your feet. Good. Why don't you walk down to the end of the room, over by that Vigor tester machine there. Take it slow now. It ain't a race. Even this game looks pretty realistic. Uh, looking good so far. Can't wait until. Uh, Go ahead and give the Vigor tester a try. Oh. We'll learn right quick, quick if you get back all your faculties. Here you go. So oh, what was I saying? Yeah, the uh. Wait, what? Sorry, trying to multitask here. Uh. Let's go to snipe. Hardy. Charisma. Keep that at five. Knowledged, Jilly, Lock, mm, I'm thinking, yes, I would. That will help out with my uh, explosive lock picking and energy weapon, but. Yeah, it would it'll be awesome to see the next gen of this game, which is Fallout 4. I got a pre-order for the uh, PlayStation 4, actually. I know they're not going to have the uh, mod support at the beginning, but you can't go, you can't beat its graphics. It's the whole reason why I upgraded to a, a PlayStation 4. Yeah, that's a pretty standard score there, but after what you've been through, I'd say that's great news. Well, we know your vitals are good, but that don't mean them bullets didn't leave you nuttered in the bighorn or dropping. What do you say you take a seat in my couch and we go through a couple of questions? What are you doing, shrinks? So All 
All right. I'm gonna say a word. I want you to say the first thing that comes to mind. Dog. Let's go train. House. Shelter. Night. Science. Bandit. Prison mall. Bribe. Crushed. Light. Reasonable. Inspiration. Mother. Cookie jar. Yeah, let's go for a cookie jar. Okay. Now, I got a few statements. I want you to tell me how much they sound like something you'd say. First one. Conflict just ain't in my nature. Mm, let's go. No opinion. I ain't given to relying on others for support. I'm always fixing to be the center of attention. Let's just go with no opinion. For I'm all. slow to embrace new ideas. I charge in to deal with my problems head on. Almost done here. What do you say you have a look at this? Tell me what you see. I see... <laughs> An angry to hit an ant. Uh, so you guys probably was see one more episode of New Vegas from me. Shadow and Door Frame. Okay. How about this one? Max kind of looks like a futuristic weapon or a ship at sea. Space Age technology. Last one. Two people holding hands. Light in the darkness, a bearded man. Kind of does look like a mushroom cloud. Let's go mushroom cloud. Well, that's all she wrote. I don't have nothing to compare it to, so maybe you'd better just have a look at the results. See if it all seems right to you. Guns, yep, sneak, yep. Speech, why not? That's a good start, actually. Next level up, I'll level up my repair. I'm surprised with that. Before I turn you loose, I need one more thing from you. I got a form for you to fill out so I can get a sense of your medical history. Just a formality. Ain't like I expect to find you got a family history of getting shot in the head. No, I don't. Built to destroy. Early bird. Fast shot. All using guns and energy weapons fired 20% more quicker. Or I, good hearted, heavy hitter, order. That might be a good one to take. When the health drops below 50%, you gain plus 10% more damage. Suffer from agility, but uh, might be okay. Kamikaze! Action points, list cannon, skilled. Your skill does not experience your gain, yada yada yada, I probably wrote, read that wrong. Five points to every skill, but you suffer minus. Uh, don't really want to do that. While using guns and energy weapons, you fire 20% more accurate. Oh, we'll do that one. Wild Wasteland. And a little bit more accurate to see. All right, I guess that about does it. Come with me, I'll see you out. Now when starting off, this is actually a good place to loot for supplies. Let me see. Blood pad. Is there anything here? 
Laser pistol. What's in here? Surgical tubing. Rad X. Stint X. Yeah, I'm so hyped for Fallout 4. You guys <laughs> don't know it. Uh, sh sure, there's nothing in there. Take all the ammo I need. What's in here? Nothing. Now I do have all the DLCs. Let's pull out my help. Here, these are yours was all you had on you when you was brought in. I hope you don't mind, but I gave the note a look. I thought it might help me find a next of kin, but it was just something about a platinum chip. Well, if you're heading back out there, you ought to have this. They call it a Pip-Boy. I grew up in one of them vaults they made before the war. We all got one. Ain't much use to me now, but you might want such a thing after what you've been through. I know what it's like having something taken from you. And put this on, too, so the locals don't pick on you for lacking modesty. Never was much my style, anyway. Uh, don't mention it. It's what I'm here for. You should talk to Sunny Smiles before you leave town. She can help you learn to fend for yourself in the desert. She'll likely be at the saloon. I reckon some of the other folks at the me. saloon might be able Brothers. to help you out, too. And the metal fella, Victor, who pulled you out of your grave. Anyway, you ever get hurt out there, you come right back. I'll fix you up. But try not to get killed anymore. Sure thing, Doc. Fault New Vegas allow you to play in a new hardcore mode that greatly increases the challenge of the game. This mode is... Uh, Simpax, heal, overtime, cap. And now let's... Let's not do that. Oh, that's bright. So this doctor's from Vault 21. There's all that stuff. Finish me and add it. There's Victor. Howdy, partner! Might I say you're looking fit as a fiddle? Don't mention it. I'm always ready to lend a helping hand to a stranger in need. Can't say that I'm familiar with the rascals. Some of the fine folks in town might be able to help you out with that. I was out for a stroll that night when I heard the commotion up the old bone orchard. Saw what looked like a bunch of bad eggs, so I laid low. Once they'd run off, I dug you up to see if you were still kicking. Turns out you were. So I hauled you off to the dock right quick. I'm a Securitron. Robco Security Model 2060B. If you ever see any of my brothers, tell them Victor says howdy. Happy trails! All right, thank you. Okay, so... Not too bad. Nice start. Uh, we'll saw key to that too. There. We'll go shotgun there. 
10 mil pistol, 9 mil pistol. I'm uh, probably going to end up selling the laser pistol. Machete up there. Sure, we'll go throwing spears there. Armored Vault 13. Leather armor. Metal armor. Tribal armor. Metal armor has minus one agility. AK. Metal armor or what? Does the leather armor? I think that's good. We'll go with that armor. Uh, should hockey stem packs. Go sell some stuff. You must be the one Doc Mitchell was patching up. The way I heard it, I didn't think you'd be walking out of that office. I've got plenty of supplies for sale. Even got some weapon mods and special ammo. Well worth the caps, if you ask me. If you're hurting for caps, I've also got boxes of surplus ammo in the miscellaneous section. They're not great, but you get what you pay for. Can do. For sale. Now, this is the first game that introduced mod. I mean, mods for your weapons, right? So that. Revolver, long barrel. So that's the scope for your 9mm pistol. Uh, having scope on a 9mm pistol is kind of useless if you ask me. Probably will pick up the barrel now. Actually, I don't really have many Thanks. caps. Take it easy. All right, let's go track down Sunny. No. Nope. Cheyenne, stay. Don't worry, she won't bite unless I tell her to. Oh, very funny. Yeah, I guess there's a thing or two I could show you. Sounds like you need all the help you can get after what they done to you. 
Meet me outside, behind the saloon. Yes, one. Nah, forget about it. It's only a point .32 pistol. Now, see the sarsaparilla bottles on the fence there? Take this and try to hit a couple of them. Where is this fence? Why do we shoot towards the building? That's the right idea. Look down the site. Try crouching down and staying still. It'll help your aim. Nice shot. Well, that's a start. But I don't reckon you came to me to learn to fight sarsaparilla bottles. Tell you what. I gotta go chase geckos away from our water supply anyway. Darn critters are attracted to it. Why don't you come along? Sure thing. Follow me. It's just down to the southeast a short ways. No. There. You can pull up your iron sights in this game. Don't worry, we'll catch up to here pretty fast. What? That was off. There we go. Now you move faster without your weapon drawn. I think there's a perk to counteract that. Well, it speeds up your movement speed a little bit more. Actually, I'm going to use a weapon repair kit. Uh, where is it? Hear that up on the ridge behind me there? We got some geckos to clear out. Bunch of little monsters is what they are. Seems like Doc Mitchell treats more gecko bites than anything else. Let's see if we can get a little closer. If we move quietly, we can get the jump on them. More likely to hit something vital that way. Yes, ma'am. Okay, you're on. Go give them hell. Oh, that one got dropped. See? You're getting the hang of it. There's two more wells that still need clearing. You want, you can come along. It'd be worth a few caps to me. Shouldn't take more than a couple minutes, especially with two of us. Come with me. We'll do.
Nice. Holy moly. If you hadn't come here like you'd done, I'd be a goner for sure. I came up here to draw water, but here, you should have what I got. You look thirsty. Thank you. Now that was some good work. Even got a little exciting there at the end. Here's a little spending money for the trouble. One more thing I wanted to show you. Thought I might teach you about living off the land and making useful things for yourself. Interested? Can't do it. All right then. We'll need a couple ingredients to get started. Gonna want some Xander root and a Brock flower. Let me think now. I know I've seen Brock flowers growing up at the graveyard, and I seem to remember there being Xander root over by the schoolhouse. Bring those on back to me, and we'll get cooking. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I think I'm going to end it there. Uh, so, yeah, this is a... Can't wait till Fallout 4 comes out. It comes out in 11 days when you guys see this. And uh, expect a lot of uh, Fallout 4 content from me when it comes out on November 10th. I can't wait. Oh, I'm so excited. All right, so if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And as always, I'll catch you next time. Peace out.